his dad. People in David Suez came stronger, a better box. Biabucci starting very fast. Hard right hand over the top by Dewey. Biabucci says, I've got your right. Warren. have to be concerned about that anymore. Jim early in the fight will throw a lot of punches. I'm already seeing Tua from his last couple of... Took to a blocking a right. They like punch out, Woody. Bayabuchi, heavyweight average is between 45 and 50 punches. Maybe it's just something about David Tua that steps up the activity level. His fight with David Izanrote produced more... That's what makes Tua Tua. Bayabuchi is very impressive to this point. 26, Ivea Boots, they both gained a little weight since then. So when they lean against each other, it's 500 pounds of muscle looking for room to move through 91 punches in round two. so far. And Ibeabuchi answers with left hooks of his own. Now they begin to chew up. Obviously with the urge to give back. Like a big offensive line go defensive line. A lot of leather popping. Here we see Tua starting to work with his left hook. The body shots around the right eye. Abrasions on the outside of his cheek. But far from the 91 about now Tua driving Ibeabuchi back. With trying to bring that right hand down. Now the right hand lands. Presses, and remember, it's get punches. Ibeabuchi showing himself to be a little bit more versatile there. And as he basically now, responding to what here in round six, to one punch with a left hook. This fighter don't quit. Not landing power shot the way he was earlier in the bout. Not nearly as it was when he was firing combinations, bowing down just a little bit in the seventh. That's the so you see David going to that hard right. Oh, just like that. Leftman has become another power punching round for. As his type of fighter has. And as the bell approaches. Curtis Cokes told us about Ike Bay flipping well below 20%. He had been landing at a 50% rate early in the bout. And to his connect percent. Good hard right hand. Counter right hand in return. And the left hook landing flung done by the hard. Has made Ibeabuchi 
so conscious of the right hand that the left hook is in the kind of all-out attack that Cokes asked him for. He has one left in him. Got the jump on him. Right hand. And he started to drop it. And wasn't blocking his cheek. And he may have Uchi. Ike about. Interestingly, in 73 punches in that round, it's still a very high output for a heavyweight. Hard left hook to the body by Tua. Two very strong heavyweights. In the latter part of round eight, and now the beginning of an excellent teaching and body rise to the level of champion. But maybe Tua will. And Both of those fighters in their 30s. left hook in return when he throws a punch like that. Left hook by Tua there with the right hand. And Tua able. As Tua has made an impression to the body. Here we see Tua using that left hand that has brought him to this point. Three hooks. A couple of months ago and now this. As he goes in against each other. Hook to the head, left hook to the body. Tua walking. The way he keeps coming, heavier. Hey guys, I saw Joe Fraser in his first fight in Madison Square Garden. Half of this fight. Middle segments seem to belong to Tua. Both fighters have had their moments. Of... Great combination by Tua. Great cut. Of our two fights tonight, Larry. Long list, if not the short list, of heavyweights you want to see again. Fight an effective precipice of clean hot punching, but I want to tell you, this is the two very strong heavyweights. Competitive will continually moving him. Fuji emerge. Comes here comes Doa at the end of the fight once more. man and two of petition both started the first firing combinations to try to get to his attention and both fighters unbeaten has been that caliber of a battle to a to a to a it may have Bucci deserved